Hello, I'm Martin Fenska and welcome to another part of Let's Play Battle Brothers. If you watched the previous point, you know that uh, we are now in pretty bad shape after the fight in the Hanging Man Fort. So, for a few days, we have to avoid some tough fights. We can probably handle, you know, the few brigands here and there. But, uh, not more. Uh, I think all of our heavies, or almost all of them, are in quite bad shape, or at least their gear is in pretty bad shape. In some cases, <laughs> the gear is just gone. And um, it will take more than two days to repair all of this. And also, we suffered three injuries. How long would that take, by the way? Three to four. Uh, three to four. And, well, the ripped ear is not the end of the world. But still, um, as I said, quite bad condition right now. So let's just try to get back to town, sell all the items that we got from the fight, and we we head north. Hopefully, we'll be able to repair some of the damage before we get uh, to the next town, in case there are some interesting quests or something like that. But um, I'll just start playing. You'll see what happens. Before we start playing, though, there is one more thing we have to do, and that's two level ups for Berengar and Friedrich. They need footwork. One of the crucial perks for uh, archers. So let's start with that. And points. Well, plus five rank skill sounds good. Hmm. Plus five fatigue. I mean, plus five initiative. Plus four fatigue. It looks like a pretty good level up. The reason why I'm taking initiative is uh, overwhelm that I want to get on the next level. And I'll try to get the same stats for Friedrich. Plus four, plus four. Problem is range defense. <laughs> it's already level nine. We have only seven range defense. Friedrich. Might be in trouble in every fight where there is, uh, or that is uh, like a ranged heavy. Thinking maybe more hit points for him, or plus three melee skill is not that bad. That's only plus two max fatigue, which is quite low. Okay, let's. Let's do it this way. Not ideal, but probably the best option that we have. And let's go to Blankenstadt. Let's try to get there as fast as possible. What is this? A few togs, some poachers. Huh. We could try this. It's just poachers and togs. We can catch them. Just experience. I mean, it, it's super easy. Let's try to kill that dog. Might be better to just switch the pike. I just have to make sure that Sobo can run away. Uh, Douglas has to run away as well. Everyone else should be fine. Maybe Kunibert should run as well. Berengar. Friedrich. Let's play it safe. Grimaud, you can probably stay where you are. move as far as possible and Sobo you will also move as far as possible just in the opposite direction it 
I think uh, they're already running away. trying. That's a surprise. These two are trying as well. I'll just stop them then. We'll kill all of them. All that we get from this are just experience, but it's basically free experience, so it would be a mistake not do the fight. about the loot but well, we get some food this is like 50 gold the ammo it's like 75 gold so why not I'll just try to go a bit faster hopefully we don't run into something what is this heading back to collect on your contract a few men step out onto the road one of them points at the Head of Kapai the Slaughter. We are the highest paid bounty hunters in these parts, and I believe you are carrying off a bit of our business. Give us that their head, and all parties shall get to sleep in their beds tonight. Oh, I know this event. Mm. This would be a really tough fight, even if we were in perfect shape. I still have to think about this for quite a while. But in our current shape, we have no chance. So I think we have to give them the head. Like the choice here is either give them the head and just get the thirteen hundred and forget about this, or die. I don't think that we can defeat them. I have seen this even like twice, and every time, or I attack them every time, and I didn't like those fights. Uh, it sucks, but you really are not in shape to fight something like that. That's a tougher fight than what we had in the Hanging Man for it. They, their average gear is better. It's almost on par with the, the Brigand leaders. And last time I saw this event, there was like 18 of them, so way too many. Okay, 1300. And what can we get for 
all the items. 406 for the silverware. Prices are going down because they don't have uh, the ambushed roads anyway. But 406 is still decent, I think. We already have two war brands. Let's sell this one. I think I'll sell another one for 330. It's a good deal. Also, I'm going to sell this long axe. We'll just repair this one. We can wait with the wing maze. Let's first sell everything that's repaired. I'll probably keep one bigger. You never know. And maybe the heater shield as well. Okay, and let's keep these one-handers. I'll just wait until they are repaired. We have more than enough food, so we don't have to worry about that, but for 266 medical supplies are not bad. They are usually over 300. I think I'll buy two stacks. All the tools and supplies. Some bandages. I think you are missing some. I think that's all we need. Let's check the bandages. That's fine. That's fine. Here we need. A wolf also needs one. And a postalist needs one. Perfect. How does it look like with ammo, by the way? 199. Now it can wait. We can get it cheaper. Okay, so what else can we get? Information. You know of... Gosh, what was it called again? To the southwest? Some way from here on the plains? Can't for the life of me remember what we used to call it. Oh, we could investigate this. It's usually undead in the area where this is supposed to be. Southwest, yeah, it's somewhere here. That might be worth a try. Nothing here. We already know about the prices. Barber's potions and nothing else. Uh, we can buy some more beer. Maybe it was a mistake. Berengard is drunk. What's the exact effect of being drunk? Berengar. Extra resolve, minus 25% to everything, 50% chance to be followed by a hangover. Uh, that was a mistake. But I didn't expect him to get drunk so quickly. How long does it last? We'll be gone by tomorrow. Oh, hey. Hello, Gizbert the Red. And hello, your your great axe. And the juggler. Juggler is uh, something I want to get in my off-camera campaign. They have extra chance to uh, hit head. They are really good with uh, shield and uh, flails. What is this? A raider? Thinking about uh, recruiting Gisbert. How much are you paying every day? I'd say 400. You'd still have enough money for like a week.
could use someone in the reserve. Okay, let's do it. I just have to get the good chest armor for him. So show me your stats. That's what I want to see. Melee skill, decent. By the way, traits. Maybe let's check that first. 90 percent chance to survive a stack down and not killed by fatality. Good. And tough is pretty decent as well. How does it look like the fatigue? And you can do something about the fatigue. Okay, so but how long do you need to do the 40 days? <laughs> we can make some changes here, first of all. You, my friend, don't need that X. Einar needs it. Maybe let's do those level ups first, student. Pathfinder. Brawny. That's the usual start. And as for points, melee skill. Fatigue. And I have no idea about the last uh, stat. Maybe I'll just take melee defense anyway. That's a stat that we have to boost as much as possible, no matter what. Hit points could be interesting, but 60 is enough. It's more important to have the defense. No, I'll still take the melee defense. It's just way too important. Hopefully it will be better now. Yeah, this is more like it. Okay. Good, 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 good. This is what we need. So, boom. You can rest for a while. But... Thinking about switching the gear around a bit. This is an upgrade for our archers. It's a really good item. So, boy, you don't need the sword in the reserve, that's for sure. is not enough. I'm gonna sell that. We can probably even sell the long axe. I'm really not a big fan of long axes. Although, um, the suggestion to use long axes instead of pikes might not be a bad idea. 14, 5. I'm comparing the stats. Uh, 14, 5, 3100, 3100. Stats are identical, except the damage is better. And the long axes have the split shield. Actually, someone with high melee skill will get the long axes. Cuniberit. And Friedrich. You can even sell both pikes. Still need some time before it's uh, fixed, but I think we should be able to get it to like 100 plus quite soon. Mm, 
And I'm not sure if uh, standing naked in the reserve would be a problem. So let's just uh, equip the armor. Also one more thing. Uh, here is our sergeant in the reserve, of course. Okay, Grimald. In that case, you'll get the heater shield. I'm gonna sell the blue one because I like the black white better. And we are down to three and a half thousand, which means yeah, we have money for seven days. We have to again make some money. Oh, wait. Does everyone have a dagger? Yeah, but we don't have bandages. I knew that we are missing something. And they don't have any more, right? No. Okay, I'll just buy it somewhere else. Southwest. It's probably gonna be well, somewhere around here, I would say. There we go. Oh, what is that? Many Orc Young. Many Orc Young is good. It's quite risky attacking them already. How does it look like? <laughs> Five. Damn. We'll have to rely on our ranged attacks, but, but many, that means like maximum 8 of them. Nah, we are fine. It's just Orc Young. 7 even. Half of them should be down before they get to us. 3 don't have, 4 don't, of them don't have shields. We don't have to worry about arrows. There goes one. Gisbert. Ah, it'll be fine. Maybe Einar can even move up. And it's gonna slow them down quite a bit. And here we'll take the high ground as well, just in case. Oh. Stun can be a problem. I'll just make sure they can't get to... It'll take a while before I get used to the name of this guy, Gisbert. Yeah. 
there we go. That's why it's panicking. Can we hit one more? Can. Ah, it's easy. Kill him. There we go, now they are running. A level up for Cunebert. Good. What about the, the loot? Salt. Some money, tools and supplies. Take everything. Okay, let's take Overwhelm. Skill, range defense, and initiative. We have enough fatigue. And what we can do is explore a little bit more in case this wasn't the location uh, they're talking about. It's still possible there might be something else. We have time, so why not? No, but I'm curious. There should be an island. It's visible under the fog of war. And we can explore a little bit more. If this is just an island. Or if there is something more interesting. Like if this is the part of this landmass. No, it looks like an island. Is it possible to cross here? No. Oh, and we have the Forgotten Rims here, but the problem is we have no idea what to expect there. And there can be pretty much anything. I'm quite sure that we are not ready for pretty much anything. 42... 39, oh, it's too early for that. Oh wait. I wanted to repair at least the head chopper. Oh, we can repair this as well. Why not? Mm, that's not worth waiting. Uh, 474 salt. <laughs> that's a good price. They don't have anything new, except they have a new quest. That's what we can check. Um, what do you want? 170, 690. For what? Return ceremonial stuff to Blankenstadt. This is just killing raiders. How much is that? 700, 860? I think we can kill some raiders for 860. These quests are usually quite easy, also the rewards suggest it's not gonna be that difficult. I think I'll take it. Um, 
actually no, it's not bad. It's just the large pack of cannon fodder. We just have to wait till night. That's the only problem. And we can do that while camping. Twenty one hours. Okay, there's no way that we repair this in time. But for a fight like this, we don't need the completely repaired gear. We just have to make sure that we attack them during the night. Oh, hey, wait, what are you guys, speeder gangers? Okay, wait there. I'll get back to you. Or maybe before I get back to them, they'll be already gone. Okay, we have to prioritize. Undead, better, more experience. And I just realized that we don't have a sergeant. It's only a few guys, which means two or three, and there are no mm, fallen heroes. This isn't the necromancer. Ah, it will be fine. We'll just kill as many zombies as possible before they can get to us. shooting so far one two three okay let's use the spear wall already there are three guys That means 14 zombies. Two of them are already dead. Okay. Let's just be a bit more aggressive. Apostles can move forward and use the spear wall here. Okay, so after this, we have one more turn before the guys can start causing problems. Try our luck. Wait.
So far this is fun, but I am a bit nervous about the guys without the sergeant. Okay, Ulf. You will move in this direction. still fine I think let's move forward I want to make sure that Gizbert and to say the Gizbert can attack the Geist never mind maybe next turn Probably the best thing we can do, just move a bit closer. Okay, Ulf. 68%, that's really nice against the Geist. Still wasn't enough. Right here. I'm trying to get a better position for the next turn. Oh. Oh, could have been worse. Lucky shot. Forty six. Nope. Zombie, so that he can move around freely. It's better. Let's try to move forward. Might be better to move onto this tile. Now, Gisbert will be affected by both guys. And one, two, Kunibert. Move forward. And shoot, but next time we should be able to attack with the pike. And Wolf is gone. Bad. That's okay. I know. 
Let's try to take out this one first. 23% like unlikely. Come on. There we go. How is it possible that this one has such a high defense? No one? Uh, Berengar probably, but that's okay. Just important that no one who is in melee range panics. There we go. Uh, level ups. Just Grimald. What about the reward? Oh, not much. But still, we need the experience. Why is it possible that Grimald doesn't have Berserker yet? Let's compare you to Apostolis. There is a difference in something. Oh, and uh, the underdog. Yeah, we needed the underdog early because Grimald was on the flank all the time in the early game. So the underdog was important. Okay, let's skip Berserker for now and we'll take Battleforged. Melee skill, melee defense. And still fatigue. These stats are just so important for the front line that I can't take something else. And Bertwin is now ready to rejoin the ranks. Maybe he can replace someone. Grimald? At least for a while. I really want to have a surgeon, so that's why I'm doing this. And you guys will swap your shields. And maybe not just shields, maybe you'll swap also the armor. Okay. And I'd like to still catch the thieves. Oh, they were waiting for us. Go, go, go. Catch them before the dawn. Brigands, just as your employer had thought, that they looked scared, presumably understanding that uh, Albaric, the guild master's well-paid wrath, is about to descend upon them. 
to arms. Tanks, poachers, marksmen, no surprise. This will be fun. Go down very easily. And I just realized I still have to move Einar to the side. Completely forget about that. Okay, that hurt. Please don't do that again. Good. <laughs> now they are. I don't know, not all of them, but like half of them are panicking. Good, the crossbowman is dead. Einar. I thought we could just jump over them and they are panicking. Well, it seems that we can't. Oh, right, we can only like jump ac across our people, not against uh, even panicking enemies. Never mind. Now they are all panicking, I think. I'd like to catch the marksman, they're probably all running. Getting like 900 for a fight like this, that's a nice reward. Compare it, it's only like 500 gold difference between this fight and uh, the fight in the Hanging Man Ford. Okay, it's over. It's a level up for Douglas and for Berengar. That's not bad. Loot, of course, is garbage.
Uh, hello. You clean the blood of your sword and then go to retrieve the item. As you bend over to pick it up, you spot a man watching you in the distance. He comes forward, uh, his two hands towed him together with long sleeves. I see you've killed my benefactor's man. Sheathing your sword, you nod at the man. He continues, my benefactor paid good money for the artifact. It appears those he paid are no longer owed, so maybe I can speak to you directly. I'll give you 590 crowns for the item. Why would I accept that? That is a good amount of money. I'll break the guild master. Howard will not be happy if you decide to accept. No, 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 no. We are paid to return it, and that's what we're gonna do. Okay, let's try to repair some of these items. The sword is worth it, the X is probably worth it as well. Oh. Just repair. Actually, this is probably not worth it. Okay, last thing, level ups. Douglas, you'll be running around, which means you're gonna need the underdog. But first, you need Battle Forged. Or. Hmm. Damage taken is reduced by a percentage equal to 5% of the total armor value. I think I'll take Battle Forged first and Underdog after that. Melee skill. I think range defense, plus three range defense. Won't see that again most likely. And of course fatigue. The other level of those for Berengar. Let's go for Berserker. Range skill, range defense. Huh. Yeah, range skill, range defense, and initiative. Two fatigue. We should get better level up than that, and we still have like four level ups to go. Okay, good. We'll wait with the rewards until the next part. This one is already quite long. The good thing is that we managed to find quite a few fights we could do while still working on the gear, so it wasn't a complete waste of time just sitting somewhere waiting for the gear to be repaired it would be like almost three days so a huge waste of time like this we at least get the experience um and still some money already have enough money to pay the company for 11 days okay looks good as i said next time we are heading to blankenstadt and unless they have another uh quest they'll be worth doing they'll finally head back north it's Almost day 70, and I expect the war to start in two weeks maximum, but, well, to be honest, I'd be surprised if it didn't start in, uh, like, one week. Hmm. Well, I guess we'll find out soon, but for today we are done, so I hope that you like this part, that you're gonna join me for the next one again, and until then, have a good time, bye-bye.